Good morning Fashion TV, this is Bruna, we're in Milan at Men's Spring Summer 2010 Fashion Week. Today we're going to follow Ryan Taylor during his day. This is Fashion Diary. So hello Fashion TV, we are here with... Ryan Taylor. Where are you from Ryan? Uh, Toronto, Canada. How old are you? Uh, 19. And where are we going right now? Uh, iceberg. You have a show there? Yes. Are we late? Yes. How long have you been modeling? Uh, for, well now I just started again, but I modeled for a year and a half originally and then took a year off uh, to finish school. So, you know, I'm just getting back into the business. <laughs> for which agency? Uh, well, here in Milan I'm with uh, Why Not and back in New York I'm with uh, DNA. How do you think this day is going to be? Like, it's your last day? Right? Last day, uh, you know, there's two shows today, so it's going to be, you know, I think mean, it's going to be quite relaxed. You know, there's no more fittings, there's no more casting, so you just have two shows, you know, do one in the morning, one in the evening, and then I'm going to go to sleep, you know? <laughs> So we just finished your iceberg show. We're going to Hermano Cervino. Mm -hmm. You're looking forward for it? Yeah, I think it's going to be exciting. There's a lot of good guys that are doing it, so it's always fun to be around that atmosphere. How did you start modeling? Oh, well, um, 
we had a family portrait done for our house and the photographer who did that suggested I go to an agency in Toronto and from there I got hooked up with agents in Milan, Paris, and New York so it just kind of took off from there. Really? Yeah. You want to tell us something about a uh, famous campaign or photo shoot you did? Um, I just recently did um, United Colors of Benetton, so that'll be exciting to see how that turns out. I think it came out a couple days ago, so I uh, uh, just need a I'm chance to see new. it. Yeah, yeah, so I'm looking forward to that. Is there any photo shoot or campaign you did in some special place that you really, really liked? Yeah, you know, I got to travel to Barcelona for an editorial before, and uh, one time I even got to go to Tenerife, which is a small Canary Island off the west coast of Africa, and we actually got to shoot inside crater of a volcano. It was unbelievable. Mm. So, wow. yeah, no, definitely an experience, you know, so something I'll never forget. And uh, no, so that was, that was cool. Someday you'll, you'll finish modeling. Mm -hmm. What are your future expectations? Well, I went, I just took a year off of modeling and to go finish school. And I just recently wrote my SATs. Um, so I'm hoping to apply at the end of summer uh, to some schools in New York City. So I want to study business at either NYU or Columbia. Is there any special campaign you would like to take part of, like a brand you really like? Oh man, there's a lot of brands that are just fantastic, you know. Um, I've always liked Bottega Veneta, you know, like Jill Sanders, their clothing is always great. I know I'll never do it, but you know, that kind okay. of thing. Uh, they tend to use like the fresher, newer boys, I mean a little bit old now. Okay, but you stopped for one year, so maybe you have some chance. Uh, maybe, <laughs> I, know, I guess there's a little bit of hope, but you know, there's you know, there's a lot of great designers out there that just you know have fantastic stuff, and it would just be a pleasure to do any of their jobs. It always is. That's just the way it goes. Feels like a way it is so long for this. I wonder if it shows. Head underwater, now I can't breathe. It never felt so good. Cause I can feel it coming over me. I wouldn't stop it if I could. Well, I take so yeah. You know you can't deny. Well, I take so yeah. Something's here tonight. Tonight, 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 You just finished your Mano Charvino show. Yeah, no, it was spectacular. I love it. Yeah, the no. clothes were amazing. Yeah, no, he did a really good job this year. All right, well, I'm starving. You want to grab something to eat? Okay, what would you like? I'm going to say sushi. Let's Japanese go for some bro. sushi? Yeah. Okay.
just had lunch and then a huge ice cream. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about it? It was the most amazing ice cream I've ever had in my life. I'm not even kidding you, it was unbelievable. Problem is, she got it and it was like that big. I was like, what? <laughs> so, no, it was great. Now I'm just lethargic <laughs> and feel really, really stuffed and want to go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and uh, after this fashion week, what are you doing? I'm actually going uh, backpacking with my little brother in the Grand Canyon. So that's going to be a cool trip. I'll be wow. going next week. Wow, so you have one little brother and that's it? No, I have a little sister as well. She's uh, a year older than him, but I don't think that's her uh, cup of tea. She's not too much into that. She's, you know, a little bit more of a diva, but she's hilarious. <laughs> she's such a good sense of humor. She cracks me up all the time. Now they're great, both of them. What if she tells you she wants to be a model? Uh, I wouldn't be surprised, you know. She's tall, she's like 5'10 or 5'9 already, and, you know, she's a cute little girl. Maybe. Maybe? Maybe. <laughs> Ryan, after ice bag and Shambino and lunch, finally you got back home. Yeah, and I'm ready to pass out, you know, do a little bit of napping before we start tonight. What's up next tonight? We are going to the D-square party. Sure? Oh, I'm sure, I'm sure, personally. <laughs> okay, so I would like to thank you so much for having your day with us. We had a blast with you, and hopefully we'll see you next season. That would be amazing. Okay, thank you so much, Ryan. Bye.